Uh, it's a big opportunity for us, especially in front of a uh, home crowd tonight. It's going to be a great atmosphere. and uh, I mean, we're looking forward to the challenge. They're going to be a desperate team out there tonight, so we're going to have to put together a full 60 minutes like we did against them last week. You weren't here through the last ten, full 10 years of this. What's your sense of you know, what the fan base has maybe been through going that long without playoffs and maybe what this means to you know, the fans? Yeah, I mean, this is... Uh, the definition of a hockey city and uh, they've been pretty hungry for playoff hockey for quite some time so like I said to to hopefully be able to to clinch a playoff spot tonight in front of the home fans is going to be uh, I mean it's going to be an exciting time for them and uh, a big confidence boost for us. Yeah, where has the uh, even keel and that ability to park it that McClellan talks about a lot? Where do you think that has been? I think just the guys in this room that have uh, come in and taken leadership roles and stuff like that I mean uh, some guys that have been there before and, and know what it's like to to battle through that and come out the other side uh, better for it. So um, it's just guys guys in this room take care of it. I mean, it doesn't take too much from the coaching staff. We've addressed it as a team uh, with the leadership group and stuff like that. So it's just uh, knowing that we can come out of it and uh, having the ability, and we've shown that this year, that we can win those tight games to, uh, to get ourselves out of the those little slumps. Sorry, Kev, like, given the stakes, do you think there will be a little bit of extra nerves in the room before you guys go out there? And how you manage that? Uh, I think it's just going to be more excitement than nerves. I mean, it's, like you said, it's, it's a big night. It's been a uh, long time coming for this city, and uh, hopefully we can go out there and, and give the fans a good show tonight and, and do what we need to do and take care of business. How about for you? What has the last little bit been like? I mean, we know you like to, to bounce back quick and have you sort of gone through the last few days. Yeah, just taking it upon myself to have a good couple days in practice. Had a good pregame skate the other night and, uh, before the Colorado game and uh, just kind of getting back to basics and just working on some tracking and stuff. I mean, the technical stuff doesn't go away. It's just getting back to what I've been doing all year and, and uh, putting it in a play tonight. Is it a good mental break to just get three or four days where you're just you know, not playing, you're really not playing, just can just stay a little bit? Yeah, I think so. I mean, I've been... Uh, carrying a pretty heavy load so far this year and to get uh, a few days off here and, and have an LB play as well as he did when he did come in was uh, was great to see. So uh, it's nice to, like you said, kind of take that mental break and, and watch him get us uh, a few big points there. So it was nice.